These two comics right here are actually artifacts of a bygone era. In school, it was probably spring of 1997, had to be the earliest of that. Uh, I was bringing comics to class a little too many. My teacher said, okay, I'm glad you're reading, Larry, but you're reading too many comics. You're bringing too many comics in here, one comic at a time. I said, well, that's not going to cut it. I didn't tell her that, so I had this idea. It's like, well, one comic, we'll just tear the cover off and reattach it. But not just reattach it normally, reattach it with extra comics. Like, comics that had nothing to do with it. Like, for example, Basic Spider-Man 343. Previous issue was Spider-Man number 75, The Death of Ben Riley, The End of the Clone Saga, which, you know, should have ended long prior. And then another issue I had is like, well, I'll just put all the Spider-Man stuff lying around them. I'm not really reading uh, Spectacular Spider-Man 219, which has uh, Salvasima on art. And that terrible Daredevil costume. But the X-Men didn't didn't escape this uh, mutilation. <laughs> it was during the Onslaught era. Uh, this comic is when I got right after Hurricane Fran had subsided and uh, got finally got power back and back of my head was healing up because I had glass uh, <laughs> cut it up pretty bad after uh, one of the windows blew out. And 113 mile per hour sustained winds for like three hours, 200 year old trees toppling over. It was two weeks without power. It was, it was tough at first, and you got used to it. So, but uh, this comic right here during onslaught stuff, Andy Kubert just all firing on all cylinders. I mean, how can you beat that? But it wasn't just this Andy Kubert issue. It was another Andy Kubert issue with uh, Jean finding out that Xavier had hots for her, even though when she was like a teenager that he was recruiting her. And uh, yeah, so a lot of interesting stuff. And there you go. Uh, Stitch these two together with. Uh, scotch tape but uh yeah it's like a problem comes up there you go there's a way to solve it uh thanks for listening and uh have a good one